What's up, YouTube? It's your boy Chris coming back with another update. So I received another package in the mail for the BMW. So let's get into the video. All right, so right here, I have a new cup holder. Um, because my cup holder doesn't work when I bought the car. As you guys can see, um, it doesn't work. Um, the spring in the back is probably broke. So I just bought a new one just to replace this one. You guys look at that one. That one works fine, but this one is um, stuck. So I'm gonna be replacing it today with this cup holder right here. I can get it out of the box. So I'm gonna be replacing it with this cup holder. All right, so this is the new cup holder. That's gonna go in to replace that cup holder right there. All right, guys, so first thing you're gonna have to do is get your uh, um, trim remover tool. You just wanna, you wanna just pop this panel up like that. So pop that up. trim come off like that you guys can see the cup holder comes out but it, it doesn't even like it's just broke two Phillips one right there and one right here so we're just gonna remove those After you do that, take the two Phillips out. Your cup holder comes out. Mine's broke. Um, it was cracked right there, so somebody over tightened it. And when I yanked on it, it just broke off. Always compare your two items so y'all can see it fits. So we're gonna take the new one and we're just gonna slide it back in. has a tab in the back, so make sure that tab line up or that notch and just put it in. Screws in now. Don't over tighten them. We got the screws back in, take our trim, and you got a clip right there with two, two pins and then another clip. I think I got it upside down. Let's turn it that way and try it again. Okay, so got it the right way this time. And it just pops like that. And as y'all guys can see, cup holder works. This one a little slow, but got a brand new cup holder now and that works.